Hello everybody, welcome back to Padfoot TD Games. My name is Zach, I am the voice behind the icon, and today we are back once again with Virtual Sailor Next Generation. Very happy to be here. Back is killing me, still broken back. We might talk about that today, but ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the beautiful Disney Wonder, welcome to Hawaii. Now, I wanted to get a further away shot. It was dark. It was dark by the time we were trying to get over here. Uh, it's actually a good time to throw that completely off the screen. Go from there. But welcome to Hilo, everybody. So very, very, very excited for our first port of call here in Hawaii. Uh, this is an interesting approach. Now, why? Well, all of them are. <laughs> because they're all tiny, tiny islands. It really, actually, now that I think about it, the only one that makes sense to me was Honolulu. <laughs> it was the only one that felt normal. So for this one specifically, uh, we are going to come in. <coughs> excuse me. Hold on. <coughs> Dying just a little bit. Uh, excuse me. So we will be coming in uh, right about, I think it's here. Now, actually, I think about it. Let me pop in. Are you able to see it yet? loaded yet but we come in we go around a seawall that is here and it's kind of like a straight in dock from there so that one's not super bad well actually hold on hold on I am a liar no it isn't this one because it's Hilo is the complicated one well second to most complicated so we go in past the seawall down and in Gosh, I hope I have enough time to do this on this trip. We'll find out. <laughs> I'm supposed to go and help Danielle at the property here very shortly. So um, there's that. Let me actually pop in here. I can actually show you. So we come in here, stay on this side of the buoys, and we dock right there. And it's really shallow. Everywhere else. <laughs> But it's going to be a beautiful day. I'm very excited to be here. Our all ashore time is uh, 8 o'clock. Actually, put it right in there. And it should be, uh, it should be a great one. So, yep, yeah, seawall right there. Come in. Go over and over and, and, and over. And the, ho and the dock is right here. Just hasn't loaded in yet. <laughs> We will check back in in a little bit as we get a little bit closer um, to be able to dock here. And then I'll talk a little bit about what we did in Hilo while we were here. So, beautiful day. So excited to be here. We'll see you guys in just a little bit. All right. We are getting closer and closer to Hilo, as you can see. The obviously entrance here and our dock right over here. More of an industrial port that's really pretty famous here in Hawaii. I think Honolulu is the only spot that I remember going to that really felt like I had a cruise port separate from the actual cargo. Um, but it's going to be beautiful and it's going to be amazing. And we've got some beautiful giant mountains where I was right up here uh, when we got to go. I'll see you guys in just a little bit as we get just a little bit closer. I want to make sure that I get you the best views that I can. All right, so we're getting ready. We're getting closer. May make this swing in. It is a it's a very like 90 degree turn over, and our final destination is right here. So um, yeah, it's gonna be a good one. Going about uh, 12 knots right now. I'm actually gonna bring that down to about 10 now. As we get closer, you know what? I'm actually feeling 12. Keep it at 12. We're going to get closer. I'll let you know once we get cl uh, to this turn as we start to kick ourselves uh, to the left here and into the bay. All right. We are at the entrance of the bay. We're just getting ourselves ready to uh, make this left-hand turn. Woo, almost forgetting which one is left and right. Travel about eight knots now. And like I said, it is a little tricky as we come through here. We've got to come and through and around and park ourselves right there. <laughs> I think I was pointing at this before. No, we're right there. <laughs> so I'm also going to do is I'm going to turn off the autopilot. I'm going to just go into an idle for right now. Well, actually, doo -doo. just to help kick uh, that turn over. 
I'll use the bow thruster if we need to. I'd prefer not to. Uh, just got to watch our turn on this approach is all. I think it's going to turn out uh, perfectly getting ourselves in there. So I could talk a little bit about Hilo, at least when we were here. Went to the very top of the mountain now. This was our second stop when we left from Honolulu to go back to Vancouver in 2022. Um, we did a private tour just because of COVID times. I'm going to give myself a little bit of push. I think the wind's pushing us pretty good. <clears throat> um, we had a great tour guide. He brought us to some beautiful Rainbow Falls. Um, then we went up to the Volcano Park, which is right up here. We were able to see some lava bubbling down in the crater, which was um, an amazing experience. We then got to go see uh, a coffee house. We got to see natural fruit. We got to just drive around the island, be around the island. It was an amazing experience. And one thing that I really want to stress to people is, is you're guaranteed to, quote unquote, be safe if you do a uh, service that is booked through the ship and the ship won't leave without you uh, if you happen to be late. But this private experience, um, I don't think I would do Hawaii any differently. Um, it was spectacular. It was very, we went to the same exact spots, same exact locations. Um, we just didn't have to deal with people. Which sometimes dealing with people just sucks. I think we can all agree with that. Okay, pushing ourselves through the bay. Got to keep that thruster on just to push us over even more. Definitely a little rock, but that's okay. That's it's a it's a tight turn. Get ourselves up and over here, and then in to right there. It's an old warehouse when we were here, <clears throat> uh, but nice and easy check in. Um, great guy. He'd been there for a very long time. He was not what we call native, but, you know, he was born there. Um, but overall, it's just um, a really good experience in Hilo. Of course, we had just done Maui, which was going up to the top of the world to watch the sunset, which got back very late. We were so jet lagged and stressed about everything else. Like, we were so tired on this day. I remember I fell asleep in the van. I was in the back seat uh, behind my dad, who was in the passenger seat. But I wish I hadn't. <laughs> I didn't ever want to feel disrespectful to the to our guide. Um, he was he was he was spectacular. <clears throat> Keep thrust kind of right around there. We are officially just so you guys can see it. Ooh, I just dropped off the ship. <laughs> we are officially in the bay, uh, almost past the breakwater. Here, well, the yeah, storm barrier. Um, a beautiful resorts. It's amazing to see the Disney Wonder here once again. And uh, then I'll show you, obviously, in the next video as we get ready to head to Honolulu next. Just double checking. Yeah. Don't want to be a liar. I mean, keep ourselves going on kind of eight knots. It, it's, it, it, it's a sweeping turn until it's not. <laughs> I'll show you why. Uh, let's pop in here. Let's pop outside. So where this buoy is in relation to the dock is, is pretty much feels like it's a straight on shot to get in. Uh, this vessel is too large to do that. So we're gonna swing over here, put on the bow thruster, get ourselves turned once again to pull in nicely. But yeah, look at, look at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful views here in Hawaii. And um, we had a pretty, pretty good days of sea. Um, it was choppy for the five days of sea. Uh, but we have some beautiful temperatures on the way down, and, you know, it's a nice, a balmy 80 degrees uh, today as this, the seasons change, and it's a big change from leaving from Vancouver, so we're happy to be here and be in the warmth, and especially going down to Australia for their summer months is, uh, it's going to be toasty. That actually reminds me, what is, let's see, Sydney, Australia, weather, I never looked that up before. High of eh, 70s and 80s. Oh, that sounds so nice. Um, seeing as it's freezing here right now. But yep, welcome to Hilo, everybody. i got to keep on watching this side now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> well, uh, we'll see you guys when we get up to this turn a little bit more. All right, so as you can see, we are skirting right along 
figure I'd kind of jump here in here and show you that. Uh, right along the sea barrier and wall here, the stone wall, and that's again just because we've got to make a pretty big turn to get in there. So I'm starting to kick us over now, keeping the speeds a little bit lower. Definitely watching. I could definitely take this in as well to see how everything is doing. Yeah, it's close. Ah, uh, so good. But I wanted to show you how close I was going to get with this. And that's just because of uh, the maneuvering ability that I have with the Disney Wonder here in Virtual Sailor is not exactly where I'd want it to be towards real life. Real life, I could be right here in the middle. I don't think that this buoy was here. I'll have to relook at my video and uh, could just kind of sweep on in. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Gotta watch that rear end, too. Oh, that's so good. Alright, we can kind of straighten ourselves out as we pull ourselves away from the wall a bit. I am going to give us a little bow thruster just to get the stern away from, from the wall. Just a smidge. For that turn. But overall, seems a good sail in over here to Hilo. Beautiful day. Only ship. Most of the places that we'll be going will only be having one vessel. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, with us at a time, which will just be us, which is uh, pretty great. And I also uh, have been informed we'll be docking at Honolulu before we head to Australia as well, which is fantastic as well. Excuse me. Oof. Body is just, just failing me at this point. Um, and yes, I did realize, uh-huh, I have not talked about breaking my back yet. We'll get there. Too technical. Too technical right now. Kill that. Click that. Check the rear. Now oh, plenty. Plenty of room. Plenty, plenty, plenty of room. Okay. Get this on. <clears throat> Just gonna let ourselves drift now. I am gonna kick this up a little bit. I wish I was going more like six knots, but bring that down just a little bit. As we get the front end of this behemoth to turn on in and over. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Uh, oh, also, we're gonna talk about like easier places to get into. Um, Maui. Ma Maui's pretty easy. You, you gotta go around a storm wall, but the dock would be, like, right there. So it's a quick in and out. <clears throat> Get there. Of course, the wind is still chip a chopping Click that. We can rely just now on the steering of the vessel. We'll keep that at idle for now. <clears throat> Excuse me. I gotta remember to take that wind file out. Ooh, it's driving me nuts. Because it doesn't sound like anything. It's supposed to be like the snapping of a flag. I don't get that. Still looking good. We we're parked pretty close up because again it's it's this building here and out and off we go. Oh, we saw the black sand beaches here as well. We actually got to see turtles laying eggs, which was awesome. So that's the other thing that we had done here. I, I remember now. It takes a little bit of refreshing from time to time. As we pull in here. Does make me want to go back to Hawaii, though. That's what Danielle and I said. We, I, I've been fortunate enough where I've been able to see a lot of the world. I've been able to be in Europe. I have seen Alaska. I've been to Hawaii, Panama, Mexico, Caribbean, Bahamas, Canada. Um, so I've been able to do a lot, but no place touched me like Austria. Uh, <laughs> dang it, <laughs> like Hawaii did. It, it hit differently, and I think the natural beauty that's still there, the culture that's there, the culture that the white people keep on destroying, 
you know, stuff like that. Um, but it is just one of those things where it's like, that's that's a place that I want to go back to. I always said the place where I want to lay down to die would be Skagway, Alaska. Um, Hawaii's right up there. Now, if I had to pick between the islands, that's that's a harder one. Uh, top of the world at Maui, that seems like a pretty good one. Um, but Hilo was beautiful. So, I, I, the one of the other places that we went as well, and we will be going there as well, is Kauai, which is Nabu Willy. My problem with that, and, and why I haven't, like, talked about it, I've talked about it everywhere else and all the things, I think it's because the shore excursion that we did was through the ship, because it was, like, the only thing to do there. And it was to go to this plantation, and it was great, and it was, this is like, a lot of food tasting, and, and, and very informative, but I think it just took me out a lot from my experience of what I had been having, like standing at the top of the world for the sunset and kissing Danielle, uh, going and seeing a volcano, you know, Pearl Harbor, e everything. Everything. So I, I think that's why I don't talk about uh, Kauai a lot. <laughs> but I'll be excited to go there. Anyways, uh, okay, here's what I can say about Kauai and, and Nawe Lily is... Um, <clears throat> That is the best docking that you will ever see me do. <laughs> we'll be there. That is like my most excited thing. And I'm very excited to recreate um, one of my favorite photos that I have ever taken uh, from Nawila Willy. It's going to be it's going to be great. I'm really excited about it. One thing that I'm not excited about and I keep thinking about it because I just I don't think about it is that when we leave from uh, Honolulu to head to Australia, we don't go to any of the islands. We just zip right out of there. And I know uh, that cruise is supposed to go to Pago Pago, American Samoa, Fiji, uh, no New Caledonia. Oh, sorry, back hurts. Um, <clears throat> before it goes to Sydney, uh, nobody's made any of those stops. Uh, so we are going to make it up with. Um, some New Zealand stops, <laughs> a couple here and there, yeah, and a couple Australian stops, yeah. Can't wait. <laughs> I I don't have an option, so it it should come out perfectly fine. Coming alongside, yeah, look at that, fitting in there just like a glove, blowing a little towards the dock because the water physics in this are a little wonky. So we'll just push ourselves just just the burst. Because I'm really watching that stern. That stern. <laughs> Find an object, look for a gap. Uh, it keeps on drifting over, but we are pretty straight on in here. Which is uh, pretty fantastic. Right around here, we did play the horn. I do remember that, so, uh, good morning. This is the duty officer speaking from the bridge. We'll be sounding our ship's horn from the forward funnel. For those of you on the open decks at this time, you may want to cover your ears. Again, we'll be sounding our ship's horn from the forward funnel. And for those of you that are on the open decks at this time, you may want to cover your ears. Thank you for your attention. And that is a greeting to our first stop here in Hawaii. To let them know that the beautiful Disney Wonder is here once again. Uh, I am excited because at least when we do come back, I do believe. Uh, now i got to look at that. Yes, when we do come back, we do stop uh, at a couple spots as well. Before we go back up to Vancouver. And then it goes from Vancouver down to San Diego. And then we're down in San Diego until we get ready to start our Alaskan season. Give it a little bit more because we're about uh, just about at one knot right now. But I do want to. We got to pull all the way forward. Like, I'll show you. Like, I'm looking here, thinking probably that block or this one. Probably that one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna nix that. I'm gonna keep on watching this. Just start easing on reverse a little bit. Usually in the water, I could just drift. Just 
Keep it about a half knot. Check up here. Of course, I'd have people out giving me this information, but it'll be what it is. Hello? My computer next to me just decided to turn off. Love it. Good thing I don't use it for... Oh, yeah, just restarted. It's the second time it's done that today. Just out of nowhere. I know it's dying, and I know it definitely needs a refresh, but come on. That's, that's my baby. All right. Coming in. Let's get ourselves stopped right here. I don't... I don't really want that much. Yes, I know that that computer is no longer available. I I can tell. Okay, just going to watch the aft is going. Give it a little bit in the bow. A little bit in the aft. Ugh, God, I wish I hit this on better controls. Of course, this isn't even, so that's not going to help us not being sideways. And I actually don't know how, I don't know where the zone is to be happy, so let's see. Right there, before it bounces out. All right, let's drop some lines. I need that open. That one looks good. That one actually looks fantastic. Can actually turn off of our running lights now because we are docked and she, she leaned a little to the left because of that little bounce back, but overall we're here. So <laughs> what do we do when we're here? That's what we do. This is the duty officer speaking from the bridge. We'll be sounding our ship's horn from the forward funnel. For those of you on the open decks at this time, you may want to cover your ears. Again, we'll be sounding our ship's horn from the forward funnel. And for those of you that are on the open decks at this time, you may want to cover your ears. Thank you for your attention. There you have it, everybody. We are officially in Hilo, which is so exciting. Our very first stop after five days at sea from Canada. We are now in the beautiful state of Hawaii. I hope that you guys have enjoyed just as much as I have getting in here, getting out of here. Mm, yeah, that's a question, isn't it? So, I have to look at my video again, but I'm pretty sure we backed up. We use this as a semi-turning basin to turn here, push the nose, and drive on out. But I will double check, obviously, to make sure that we're keeping with some sort of accuracy uh, as we will head off to Honolulu uh, next. So that's going to be very, very exciting. But that's going to do it for this one. If you guys enjoy, we do try to get a video out here on the channel every single day, and we really do appreciate your continued support, especially with this series. Everybody seems to love it, and I love making it, so we're going to keep on doing it. But with that, I thank you guys so much for coming out to this one, and we will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.